campaign has clearly stated that he will impose 100% ban on the sale of alcohol. And now after he has come into government, he has in fact increased the sale of alcohol in the state of Andhra Pradesh. When Mr. Naidu was the chief minister, the income for the state from excise, that is the sale of alcohol, was mere 6,500 crores. But in the recent budget, they have uh, made provisions for close to 22,000 crores to be received from alcohol. So it is a clear indication that the government is depending on alcohol. And parallelly now what has happened is illicit liquor is uh, being produced at a very great scale in the state of Andhra Pradesh. And because of illicit liquor, in one town, close to 25 people so far have died because of it. And when, I, when we spoke to the doctor, they said more people, there, there is chances for more people to die because multiple organ failure is currently happening and we have to take ample precautions is what the doctors there are saying. On this subject, in the council, all, all the members of Telugu Desam party ask the government, as per the rights of the council member, ask the government to come for a debate. You know, what happens in this government is Mr. Jagan Reddy himself kills his own uh, uncle and claims it's a heart attack. This happened in 2019. Similar now, people died because of illicit liquor and they're claiming it is natural death. And this is how sad the state of affairs in Andhra Pradesh is. If that is true, why are they scared to have a discussion? It is really unfortunate that the CM is also taking numbers and very casually saying people have died through because of natural causes. And the irony of this entire thing is the minister in the house said four people, if I'm right, four people died because I was not in the house. Whatever I've seen in you, that four people died because of illegal liquor. That means there is illegal liquor. That means people have, uh, have uh, consumed illegal liquor. What is the action that you have taken? Nothing. And, and our, our leader, the leader of opposition, Mr. Naidu, is touring those areas. And you know, he's actually uh, showcasing what exactly happened. And you know, what, whatever the illegalities in the government are there, he's clearly exposing it in front of people. So what is wrong in that? Why are they getting so agitated? I don't understand. And it's a clear uh, indication that the government is trying to hide on what exactly happened there. That's the issue, to clear any doubts that anyone in the state has. And the government, four hours, was unwilling to come to the debate. That's clear that they want to run away from the discussion. They want to run away from the subject. On this issue, not only today, tomorrow also, we will definitely hold the government accountable. And our demands are very clear. Our first demand, the Chief Minister of Andhra Pradesh should resign, bearing moral responsibility. Number two, for every family, 25 lakh rupees, ex gratia shall be announced and dispersed in 48 hours. Number three, a judicial or a CBA inquiry must immediately be ordered by the state government of Andhra Pradesh. But, but With these three demands, we are fighting against the government. But from government